So I'm going to continue in here because I need to get to the uh, blue white wire from the start button which runs over to the high low switch for my time delay relay and the HID headlight. And here's the back side of the gauge mount, attack and speedo mount assembly. I need to get to this cluster of wires. So it looks like I need to take the uh, tack drive off or tack cable off, speedo cable off, and these two bolts or these two nuts. And I should be able to pull the whole thing forward and get to this get to this wiring. See you in a minute. Okay, breaking that the gauge gauge uh, cluster loose hasn't helped me any because the bundle of wires I'm after is right down there. It's hard to see. It's right behind the fairing weight. So I think I'm going to take that fairing weight off anyway. So I've always been curious how much it weighs. <laughs> Weird looking thing. Alright. So there's a fairing weight. 8.2 pounds. Number 3.0. Who knows why it says that. So this is the little time delay relay I'm using. This is uh, hot from your switch source. So this would be hot from the start button for the headlight. So this is going to connect to the blue-white wire from the start switch. This is going to connect the ground, and this these are the relay leads, so they're normally open until the timer tells it to close. And this is going to connect, one of these two is going to connect to where we did cut the blue-white. So in other words, the orange is going to go here, which leads to the start button, and one of the whites is going to go here which leads then uh, continues over to the high-low switch. There's my splice into the blue-white and bundled type with uh, electrical tape. Alright, well I've got the uh, wire lead here and I fished it down, I uh, plugged it back in here, here's the red back into the bucket there behind the fairing weight and I fished down my lead here right down here I'm going to zip tie that up and, uh, into the fairing here, back around to where I have the HID uh, ballast and relay. Okay, so I have two wires coming from the um, blue white I intercepted. And uh, so, what I'm going to do here. What we have on this relay is this is the positive, so this gets the switched hot from the start button, this orange, and then this um, is going to supply the power to the relay coil, or not the coil, but the relay contact, which after a time period is going to close, and that's going to send it back on the blue white wire back to the blue white eye, or black. It's going to send it on the black back to the blue white I intercepted so I just need to find the ground for the relay and I'm gonna grab that from here and the fairing off the uh, off this cluster <laughs> yeah here uh, this is the ground I have running directly to the battery for the HID light in the relay okay all wired up ready to go ready for a test Turn the key on. One, two, three, four. It's like four or five seconds. Push the start button. Surprise! It started that good. Must be those. Uh, must be those coils. Okay. Turn the key off. Key on. 
There's a delay. Okay, start it. There's delay. And there we go. Okay, I set the time a little bit longer, like close to 15 seconds. You know, times maybe it won't start or something, you're playing with it. Turn that little screw there. I don't know what it's called. So, key on. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, like fourteen, fifteen seconds.